Welcome to Sandwiches of History. Today, for 1001 Sandwiches of 1936, we're going to be making the Queen Club Sandwich. Ah, uh, not the Queen's Club, the Queen Club Sandwich. First thing we're going to do, toast some bread. Combine minced chicken with mayonnaise. And no, it doesn't say how much on either of them. Now, on a piece of buttered toast, we put a leaf of lettuce, our chicken and mayonnaise mixture, cover with another piece of buttered toast, top that with some fried mushrooms, and top that with another piece of buttered toast. Okay, let's give this Queen Club Sandwich a go. It's fine. I mean, it is pretty bare bones, and despite the presence of mayonnaise, it's pretty dry. Um, I do want to pulse it up a little bit. I'm going to add a little black pepper, salt, and a little bit of blue cheese. Okay, let's give this Queen Club plus up with a little salt, pepper, and a little bit of blue cheese. A go. And no, if you don't like blue cheese, you won't like this, but blue cheese, sharp, tangy, contrasts with the uh, fried mushrooms and the chicken, and just brings a lot of flavor to the party. And let's face it, a little bit more moisture to the sandwich. I think I want to do one more plus up. I'm going to add some bacon. Okay, let's give this Queen Club sandwich plus up with salt, pepper, blue cheese, and bacon a go. So now we have this crispy, smoky bacon that's playing off the mushrooms, playing off the blue cheese, playing off the chicken and the mayonnaise and the lettuce. This is delicious. <laughs> okay, a couple things real quick. Uh, first of all, we all know that bacon can plus up pretty much any sandwich. So it's kind of like a cheat code, which is why you don't see me use it too often here on Sandwiches of History, because then it'd be Sandwiches of History plus bacon. Normally I hold off uh, from adding it to sandwiches, especially if they don't have any uh, meat in them. This had chicken in it, so fair game. Um, the other thing is you might have noticed when I bit into the toast, it didn't crunch like it normally does. That's because I made the toast, then I got distracted and had to do some other things and well, you know, the toast got a little soft. What are you gonna do? It's a real working house here. Uh, the original Queen Club sandwich, I think is gonna be about a six and a half. It was a little dry, but it was tasty. Plus up with salt, pepper, and a little blue cheese, seven and a half. And then plus up with bacon on top of the blue cheese, salt, and pepper, eight and a half. That is delicious. I am definitely gonna finish that, and I would make that again in a hot minute. <laughs> All right, see you tomorrow. Welcome, well, <laughs> You should go and laugh. Uh, oh, good, we're down here. Welcome to Sandwiches of History. Welcome to Sandwiches of History. Today, for 1001 Sandwiches of 1936, we're going to be making the Queen Club Sandwich.